How's it going, everybody? Today, we're going to be exploring Florida in GeoGuessr in my quest to get a 25k in every U.S. state. Florida is one of the most populous states in the country, a lot of big cities and beaches and amazing things to explore, so I'm excited for this. Now, I'm going to try to get onto the top three leaderboard here today. I think these times are doable. Hopefully, I can clutch a second or third place. Would be really nice. Okay, let's hop in. Live split, keeping track of our time in the top left. And as always, make sure to leave a like down below. Let's do this. All right. Our streets are 7th and South, so we're in a city. That's always a good start. So let's get to this larger road here and hopefully figure out what town it is and see if we're lucky and maybe I've heard of it. Whitfield, that could be our place name. South and Gall Boulevard. All right, let's keep moving. Surely something will give us highway numbers or the town name. Got to keep in mind Whitfield, though. Here we go. Road numbers. US 301. Oh. Not too sure where that is, but here it is. Okay. So how far does this go? That goes pretty far, so we gotta look for more stuff. Alright, so we're just keeping on moving south through this town, and while I have this chance, let me ask you guys, have you been to Florida? Maybe you're from there as well, I'm sure a lot of you guys are. Let me know in the comments what your experiences with Florida are. I've been there twice, uh, once when I was very young to go to Disney World in 2005, and then another time in 2014. So, we got some signs though here. Tampa, Crystal Springs, so we're gonna be around here then. Plant City is here. Alright, so it's gotta be something in this area. Crystal Springs, Plant City. Oh, Florida 39. That's even better, okay. 39, 39. Here, ah, Zephyr Hills then. Alright. Back to the starts. We were at 7th and South. Let's see if this lines up. I think so. Here's 7th. There's actually a lot of 7ths. We're on 7th Street. <laughs> and here's South. Awesome. Alright. Not too bad to start. There we go. Next one, we're at Buckner and Broadway. So, another town. Always good. Everglades Tours. Okay, so we're going to be more down here. And again, just try to figure out the town name, either through highways or just telling us the town, and we'll be good. Looks kind of interesting here, actually. This area. Wow. Your city hall. Come on, tell me the city. <laughs> what city? <laughs> Collier County Courthouse. I don't know that. Damn it. Uh, it doesn't say the city on here, really. That's too bad. Okay, well, we'll look for other stuff. You know, I want to go back to this, like, more main section. City of Everglades. <laughs> We're just in the city of Everglades. Everglades City, yeah. Okay, very interesting round to get. This is cool. But we're at Buckner and Broadway. Here's Broadway and Buckner. Okay. Oop. I accidentally just opened up the Chrome Help Center, so I had to pause the timer here. We're back to it now, though, so let's unpause and keep on moving. Actually split. There we go. All right, next round. We're on County Road 2311. And this is Crestbrook. Gen 1. So we're not going to go down there, but... Oh, I thought there was a town. Nate's. Nope. Okay, so we got that. Crestwood. County Road 30... 211, I think. <laughs> I already forgot. This looks very rural, though. This could be tough. Gonna head north, and hopefully we hit something. Yeah, rural Florida rounds are always brutal. Oh, man. Oh, did we really just hit more Gen 1? Tell me we get out of it. Doesn't look like it. Okay, we're gonna go uh, south then, I guess. And hopefully not hit Gen 1. If we get stuck in Gen 1, like trapped on both sides, that's gonna really suck. I mean, logically, that shouldn't happen, but uh, we'll see. I'm always worried for it, because it could. Going this way also is very rural. There's nothing here. Just your random one-off homes and developments, but otherwise, it's nothing. Coming up in four minutes, so I'm going to talk a bit more about what I've seen in Florida. Uh, 2014, my trip in 2014 was a little bit less Disney-focused than the first one, so we did go check out Kennedy Space Center, and we did get to see a Falcon 9 rocket launch, which is really amazing. One of the coolest things I've seen in my life. I should have a picture or video of that or something. I'll send that in Discord if I do. It was so amazing. Okay, we're coming up on a stop sign here. That's good. Come on, give me something, please. Uh, Deer Point Lake. Oh, 2311. I switched to 3 and 2. <laughs> we got that, though. Deer Point Lake. Oh, come on. Anything. Anything. Public boat ramp is useless. I mean, this kind of reminds me of, like, this area, this rural panhandle type of stuff. Beyond that, though, I really don't know. So let's head this way. Five minutes. Come and gone. This round's taking a while. 
There's some sort of... Oh, this is like a high school. Please tell me the city or county. Lynn Haven. That sounds familiar. Okay, I'm going to keep that in mind too. What school is this? Tell me, <laughs> please. They have no school pride. <laughs> All right. Yeah, they, they don't say what school it is. Does this sign have anything? No. I don't know 850 area code either. Okay, Lynn Haven though, that does sound really familiar. I'm trying to think what that is. Yeah, here's Lynn Haven. Okay. Good, good, good. So, maybe we're around here. Next order of business, try to find County Road 2311. I don't know how we're supposed to do that. Here's 2301, so it does look like the r numbers are kind of right. It's just a matter of how far out from Lynn Haven are we. Here's 2311, okay. Good, back to the start. Uh, yeah, we had that, and then Crestwood. So the road's going northeast here. Come on, we can do this. Is this it? Crestbrook. I thought it was Crestwood, but it's Brook. It doesn't matter, we got it. Round four. Okay, I'm just glad that's over with. That was tough. This is Eden and Cooper Roads. This is more residential. This will hopefully be better, you know, more suburban. So let's see what we get here. Larger Street, US 41. Nice. That's a big road in Florida, so we should be good to get this. If I can find 41, I always forget where it goes, but yeah, here it is. All right, so 41 and Eden. Now we just got to figure out the town. Central Motel. Hmm, what's going to tell us the town name here? Oh, maybe this. Nope, Citrus Liquors, okay. <laughs> oh, come on, have some civic pride. 352 area code, don't know that. Oh, Citrus County. Um, oh, don't know where that is either. Man, all these things. But here's Florida 44. Okay. So that's something else to look for then. There's 40. Oh, we're on 27 now. Whoops. <laughs> I gotta go this way. Here's 44. Ah, okay. Are we in Inverness then? I guess so. Back to the start. We are at Eden and Cooper. Let's get this. Hopefully we're here. I really hope this is right. Did we... I forget which way we went to hit 44. No... Did we go north to hit it? <laughs> oh no. Oh yeah, here's Eden, okay. Eden and Cooper, there it is. All right, one more round. Let's try to get this done in under 10 minutes. It might be hard. This is, again, residential, which is good. Um, let's see the streets. Silent Brook and Stanfield, okay. There's something on those street signs that I don't know. Uh, but what does this say? I don't know, not useful. All right, let's try to get out of the suburb. Come on, here's a big intersection, or larger intersection. Street here is... Orangewood, okay. Let's head on down Orangewood then. Come on, I don't. we're not gonna get top three here. I can see why the times are a bit slower now though, because you do get some harder rural spots. But hopefully we can get close to 10 minutes, or you know, 11, something like that. We'll see. I don't know, these suburb rounds can be tricky too though. If you're just too far gone from anything major, you're just in this network of strodes. Yeah, we went the wrong way here, so we're not going to get anything. I'm going to go back to the start then and just work my way back to Orangewood, which is over here, I think. All right, yeah, let's go south this time. Or no, we went south to start. We're going to go north. <laughs> yeah, definitely not getting 10 minutes, that's for sure. Okay, this feels a little more promising going this way. Williamsburg Downs. Williamsburg is maybe our place. I've never heard of that, though. Greenberg. Okay, there's there's a lot of things. <laughs> All right, what's this street? Something about Florida. Central Florida Parkway. Okay, well, that's helpful. <laughs> I guess we're in Central Florida somewhere. Uh, so we'll click by Orlando, then. All right, let's head this way now. Williamsburg. Is that a town? That doesn't sound familiar, but it, it honestly could be. I don't know, we gotta just find more. Come on, one of these junctions has gotta give us a highway number or directions. International Drive, this looks promising, come on. Directions, yes! Aquatica, SeaWorld, they are, so we are close to Orlando then. SeaWorld is somewhere down here. Williamsburg, that's the place. Central Florida Parkway, Orangewood. All right, back to the start, we're almost there. Streets here were Silent Brook and Stanfield, that's right. There we go. 
Oh, okay, we got that done. 11-19, Florida perfect score. Not too bad. Honestly, I'm pretty happy with that. I'm not super good with Florida cities, so honestly, I'm happy with my efforts. But yeah, overall, pretty happy with this. Thanks for watching, guys. Make sure to leave a like down below and subscribe to keep watching new episodes in the series, and I will catch you next time.